hello yogi and welcome to my channel i'm lamai and today is day seven of our christmas yoga party corona friendly yoga party with social distancing and everything in check so today we're going to be practicing snowball happy baby pose without taking too much of your time let's get started and have fun together for today's pose we're going to start in reclined pigeon pose so come to your back Bring your feet on the mat and take a couple of breaths just to settle into your practice. You can bring your hands on your chest, your right hand on your chest, your left hand on your belly button. And with your feet up, you may feel already blood flowing to your head. Just take a couple of minutes here. During this week or during these 10 days leading up to Christmas, we're trying to we're practicing gratitude. So thank yourself for showing up for day seven. You made it. And if you only stay here, that's perfect, it's enough. Bring your right feet on your left knee for a reclined pigeon. Open your hips, let your knee fall to the right. You can lift your hands where they are or bring them close to your body. You have the option to stay here or to lift your left leg from the mat. Inhale and exhale through the nose. Option to stay here. If you're practicing close to a wall, you can place your left leg on the wall. Bring your hands towards your um, between your your legs and grab your left hip or your left thigh from outside and you have the option to pull your thigh inwards while pushing your knee out that's welcome you can do that or you can just yeah stay where you are you can lift your leg on the wall on the table anything it doesn't have to be strenuous relax you're already doing a hip opener here preparing what's a snowball yeah we want to be a snowball today christmas themes let me know what you think about the christmas themed yoga poses i find it fun i hope you find it festive i hope it's festive enough for you to have this christmas themes bring your knees um, bring your feet to the mat and switch sides so I've been recording all day and I've, I'm realizing and noticing now my voice is kind of losing my voice. Inhale and exhale through the nose. Let everything go. Let your knee fall towards the left. And whenever you're ready, you can stay here or lift your leg up. Come up. And if you have a wall, yeah, you can place your left leg on a wall can stretch it out your right leg on a wall you can place it on a table on a chair whatever so that it's really comfortable for you and you can just tuck your left to your left knee a little bit outward optional everything I'm saying it's optional so just listen to your body do what feels good or you bring your hands between and grab your left right thigh from inward you can use your left elbow to push out your left knee Four things you're grateful for. 21st of December, what are you grateful for? Inhale and exhale through your nose. And yeah, count your blessings. I'm grateful for my body. I'm grateful for my yoga practice. I'm grateful for this yoga party with you. I'm grateful for my self-love journey, taking the time for myself. Being present on your mat is a great sign of self-love. Inhale deep in and out, release. We'll do a reclined child pose. That's one of the first steps towards our snowball. So bend your knees, bring them towards your chest and you can wrap your knees. And just try to like like a snowball bounce around left and right roll around imagine a snowball on a hill 
so it's going to just go rolling 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 down but this one is stuck somewhere it's just rolling left and right give yourself a little massage massaging your back your spine and when we're going to happy baby pose you have the option to stay here in this white legged white legged child's pose with your knees open or you can follow along so come back to center and open your knees bring your knees towards your shoulders point flex your feet so try to start moving your feet towards the, the ceiling to point up you can stay here or if you want you can hold your pants or your feet your ankle and let your feet keep on showing towards like pointing towards the sky or the ceiling whatever you're practicing so let your feet keep on showing up so this is already a happy baby option you could stay here holding your ankle and if you can if it's possible for you bring your elbows in inside your in the inner part of your feet and grab the outer part of your feet the inner part of your leg and grab the outer part of your feet instead like lightly bringing your knees towards the mat and like a snowball again just be rolling left and right roll 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 ho 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 it's Christmas oh it's nearly Christmas Christmas season and you can also think about things you're grateful for count your blessings name them one by one just count your blessings maybe you have a new member in your family maybe you met someone new in your life made a new friend a partner count yourself um, be grateful for those people for the new additions to your family maybe you learned something new this year and maybe someone left the family into or left the body into the astral world Be thankful for this person's continuous continuation of their journey my grandfather left us this year he made his transition so I'm thankful for his transition inhale and exhale through the nose in and out Oh, we had an additional addition to our family also my sister had her first daughter so my little niece again yeah joined our family after my grandfather transitioned so I'm grateful for that addition to the family inhale through the nose in and out my friend got engaged I'm grateful for that so you may think about things you're grateful for it must not be directly in your life you could be happy for other people a friend of mine is having a baby also grateful for that on the next inhale bring your feet back together tuck in your knees and we'll have Hock your knees in in a reclined child's pose for a couple of breaths. Inhaling and exhaling through the nose. Let all let go of all the tension in your body. On the next inhale, grab the back of your knees and start swaying from front and back. A couple of times back in do that a couple of times and have fun doing this I really love doing this like the child in me like wakes up I'm like ooh and you can be faster your legs can go up and have fun yay and just do this three times and meet me seated you can add a sound effect woohoo and let's meet in a comfortable seat 
Take a couple of breaths. Calm your mind, calm your body. Thank yourself for today's practice. Thank your hips for playing along. Thank your brain or the inner child in you for waking up and playing with you also. I hope you were able to play. I hope you found this up and down movement fun. <laughs> I love it so much. <laughs> okay. So thank you very much for practicing with me. Thank you for the love. Thank you for the comments so far. The light and the love in me recognizes the light and love in you. Namaste. So don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you tomorrow in day eight. Yeah, tomorrow is day eight. So keep practicing and come back tomorrow for day eight. Bye bye.